Catherine's asking about, have I looked at the chart at Ron DeSantis and his connection with the United States chart? Um, it's too early. The reason is, okay, did you not hear the name Jeb Bush for four years when uh, the second term of Barack Obama, after he won, all we heard was the name Jeb Bush, Jeb Bush, Jeb Bush, the best Florida governor of all time. Everyone loves him. Everyone likes him. Unlike his brother, he's smart. He can talk. He's personable. Right. So, you know what I'm saying? Um, Jeb, 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 Jeb is a sure thing. He's going to win. And then, boom, he gets knocked out early. Now, I have seen this happen. How many elections with it? The guy who is number one, he's the sure thing. Trump is out. It's over. It's DeSantis. And now you have CNN talking about DeSantis, actually praising DeSantis. You know what that tells me? That tells me DeSantis might be overrated. He could be the next Jeb Bush. Now, some of you are saying, no, William, you don't understand. That's heresy. Listen to me on this. Every time I've seen this happen, where the sure, the, the guy who is going to win the nomination from day one always ended up either not running because of a scandal or some situation, or they imploded, right? Early on, they lost Iowa. And then they said, oh, we're going to come back. And then they lost New Hampshire and got second place. And then they got blown out in South Carolina. And 70% of candidates drop out after, seven, I think it's 80% South Carolina primary. So I'm not convinced about DeSantis like every astrologer on the planet is, like every psychic, like every Republican, like every Democrat, like every independent. DeSantis is the guy. We need not to look elsewhere. I don't believe that for one minute. Now, that doesn't mean he won't run. The moment he runs is the moment I note the time, look at the chart, then I look at it. Because um, I don't have his birth time, but I can assure you uh, I've seen this happen so many times. Also, in 2025, when I look at the transits to 2025, it looks like whoever is the next president is going to be radically different than the type of leadership we've had. The question is, is DeSantis, right, got that quality, got that energy. And, you know, I see him speak and I was expecting a lot more. And I'm like going, this guy is very scripted. But, you know, Bar uh, Obama was better scripted. Uh, well, Obama was scripted, but at least he could give better, he, you know, he could rile people up. Right. You could get you have to hand that to Obama. So I don't know. I'm not convinced on DeSantis like everybody else is. So I'm going to wait and see. He's in my gray box for the moment. You know, it's just sort of like I kept hearing your theory, you know, it, you, like DeSantis is like Ethereum. It's going to blow pet. William, you don't know. Bitcoin is over. Ethereum's going to take over. Ethereum, Ethereum, Ethereum. What happened to Ethereum? Right. It's still a thousand, still twelve hundred bucks. <laughs> Come on. Right. So, you know, could Ron DeSantis be the Ethereum of politics? To watch the full presentation and more like this on geopolitics, the economy, and world events from an archetypal and mundane astrological perspective, join the Global Transformation Astrology membership. Go to gta.williamstickevers.com. Become a GTA member today.